Hello guys and welcome back to another video so today I'm gonna be talking to you about the dark secrets of this forerunner vanity sets so basically if you've played recently this weekend uh, you could buy this set from the store and you could buy it for 400 plat now the problem with this was uh, every time you bought it, um, obviously there were only 10 in the shop at a time, every time it reset, and the cooldown was for 4 hours. So basically, if we do the maths, in 48 hours, with a 4 hour cooldown, there's 10 for runner set per reset, You can there's only 124 runner sets for each class. If all the 10 sets were bought every time, which I think it was, which it might explain the high price. Um, because, yes, it does look cool, and there's not that many in the game at all. So, and I was lucky enough to catch myself one. The problem with this. It's like they are hoarders, plat hoarders, right? You know, there's people who found plat and they just buy it. Every time it's in the shop, they just buy one and keep them. Because I bet the price of this vanity is going to go pretty high. And then they will sell it. Now, the best thing that SDS could have done was to make it so that only you can buy only one with, like, you can only buy one set with your account, right? To prevent people from buying multiple because I think it's just not fair. It took me three tries to buy one. And I bet there's the same people that buy it again and again. Kind of unfair, but this was just for rogues. Right? Because I'm a main rogue. But yeah. So there's only 120. I just didn't really think it through. There's still people who I bet tried to get one and couldn't. Maybe because of ping issues, which is totally understandable. Um, but yeah, there's selfish people out there who just um, run plat and then just they just take these items and keep them for themselves until the price go high enough. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. That's all I wanted to say. SDS, I think, could have done a better job. I'm happy I got myself one. Um, I, there was double plat offers. I suggest you guys do them as well. Who knows? Maybe in the future you'll be able to get yourself one as well. It's, by the end of the day, if you do plat offers, you get kind of free money. You put in effort and you get money, right? There's tons of ways to make money, but this is one of the ways. And this is the one I suggest that works the best. For me, and it has worked. Not open cases, just buy something that sells for quite a big price. Because if you open locks, chances that's gambling. Chances are you're not gonna get anything good. And if you do, it was just lucky. And yeah, but thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. See you in the next video. Peace.